we're going to check the guitar body, make sure that there isn't any any stuff down here in these in these cavities here. It's all cleared out in the corners. And as Alex said, we're going to just kind of press that thing down in there, and I'm going to see. Uh, that's I can sort of get that in there, but to get it out again, I'd have to wrench on it, right? So that's too tight. So what I'm going to do is I've got some sandpaper over here. This again, is some fairly coarse sandpaper. So I'm going to sand with this surface flat. A couple of strokes. There's something right there. A couple of strokes this way. A couple of strokes that way. Not very much. And I'm going to test it again. Okay, so it went in a little bit further, but still not enough, still a little bit too tight. So this is another one of those operations where you don't get carried away, you just do a few. Okay, it's getting better. But if I have to wrench it too much to get it out of there, I'm going to end up breaking off these little, little tabs right here. And then you have a, a new feature on your guitar. And we'll have that situation happening over the course of the week where we have maybe things you didn't intend to happen happen and we just call those those are new features right you have it's part of your customization okay. you would never use like beeswax or something like that or give it a little no because we don't we don't you know, because we're going to be putting finish on this, right? And if we have anything that absorbs into the wood, then that's going to keep that finish from... There we go. Okay, so there it is. It's pushed in tight this way. It's pushed in tight there. Notice I pushed it down. I didn't try to push it in because of that taper. And it's not wiggly. It's not wobbly. I'm also looking at this seam right here. And making sure that that's tight, okay? If it's not, then there might be something on the bottom of the neck or on, in the pocket that's causing that. So we don't, because what's, we're gonna be measuring across this way, if this thing is up or down at all, that's gonna change the uh, dimension. So a little, uh, little lesson there, okay?